In the years between 2012 and 2022, milk and platform stock and rate has increased from 2 to 2.7 livestock units per hectare on Irish dairy farms. Six week calving rate has also increased in that time frame, with another 7% of the national herd calving in the first six weeks every year on Irish farms. Closing up the farm at the correct average farm cover in early December has never been as important to hold a reserve of high quality feed in paddocks for 2025. My name is Joe Murphy. I am farming in Venice Bridge, County Kilkenny. I am in partnership with my parents and we're milking 130 cows on 43 hectares and it's a spring cabin system we have going. So the average farm cover at the moment is 762. Um, cows are on 8 kilos of grass, they're on 5 in the parlour, 2 sire hulls and 4 kilos in a silage. Um, we're getting the silage and sire hulls after milking and out to grass then. Um, I scanned the cows, I have 10% empty and I've been keeping them but I'm getting rid of them now from next week on. So that will reduce my demand and help me a small bit anyway. So this week we grew 32 from my grass walk and um, my growth has been back a little bit very all year so it has. Um, I've been growing 40, 50 most weeks so I have. Um, I've grown 11 tons so far this year. So I'll be closing my first couple of paddocks next week probably from the 12th of October on and um, I'll be closing hopefully at 700 or in around anyway and open farm cover then of 1000 the 1st of February when I get cows out and have a row of cows going to the tank hopefully. So I done a grass budget on pasture base about three weeks ago and um, I probably will stay feeding silage until the year is out and side hold as well I'd say until I run out of them anyway um, just to stay building grass and have a closing farm cover of 700. Um, if I didn't stay feeding the side, I'd say I'd run out of grass fairly quick, so that's the plan anyway. So I'll be closing these two paddocks next week. Um, they're right beside the milker parlour, and I have a roadway access to the two of them, and I have a handle on every second stake, and it's just easy to for the cows to come in and out of them, and the two wash trucks here as well on each paddock, so kind of suits early in the spring to graze them. So I get hopefully get two more grazes in this paddock before I close it. Um, I won't close it until the end of October. Um, it's the furthest away paddock from the milk parlour. So um, I won't have cows out on it until the end of February. So this will be probably the very last field I'll be closing. Um, I have to cross a roadway to get into it. And it's not the easiest field to graze, so it's not. And um, I'll probably wait until last week of February or the first week of March to graze it with the cows and that'll be the plan anyway.